Hello, my name is Ruben de la Iglesia. I work as a project manager in Comap, and in this video, I'm going to show you what to do if you forget your administrator password. The, administ the administrator password is really useful. For example, in GenConfig, if you want to write your configuration, you are going to need it. But also, in IntelliMonitor, if I go to IntelliMonitor right now, you will see that sometimes it could be some set points block that you can see here in gray and it's needed to be logged in as administrator to come modify them. To can restart our password, we need to go to the ComUp website and use our friend IntelliBot that, it, that he will help us during all the process. He will ask us for some information that it can be found in monitor, control archive info. This information is gonna be the serial number that also can be checked in the, in the physical controller. I remember you monitor control archive info. And there you can see the serial number there that we are going to need it during the process. The other one is in the values. So we can go to this icon here, open the values, and then we need to go to the info. And there we will see the password decode. And we will also copy this number because we are going to need it during all the process. Now we need to go to the website, to come up website. Once we are in the website, we need to go to support and here going to IntelliBot, as I mentioned before, and then we have a password issue. Then we want to restart the controller password. So we just need to click in the first option. Once clicked it, it asks us for the name of our controller. That means which kind of product it is. In my case, right now I have an IntelliSys NTCBB. So I just put ISNT NTCBB. Once I put it, I let IntelliBot work and it asked me about the password decode and, and the serial number. So I'm gonna put there and copy the numbers that I saved before. I have it here. The first the serial number, then the password decode number. So again, I copy and I put it here. And then I let IntelliBot work. We wait for a little bit and then he comes us with some information that the password has been sent to this email. This email usually is our email, but it's the email of the person who buy the controller. And we will get an email that it will look like that with the password that it will work right now. So I can go to enter password. I can put the password one, two, three, four and then I'm logging, okay? And I can already modify the set points. If I go to monitor, change password, I will be able to modify this password. I just need to put a new password, for example, zero and zero. And then the password, it will be changed. In case that IntelliBot fails, it's not the end of the world. You can contact us and you, can, you are gonna need to give us the serial numbers and the decode password that we mentioned before. To contact us, you can contact us the normal way that it will be our email support at comapcontrol.com or technical department, okay? Or also you can contact your distributor. Anyway, here in the website, in help desk, you have all the information of the technical support that we have, phone numbers, etc. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.